The first shipments of kids-sized COVID shot doses should arrive in Alabama today. And Wade 31's Luke Hydas is joining us live right now with how many doses the state expects to get. Hey, Luke. Chris, Megan, 18,000 doses making their way to Alabama right now, going to places like, well, this, hospitals, as well as other places that we're used to seeing COVID vaccines, places like hospitals, doctor's offices, retail places, as well, urgent cares, as well as those public health departments that so many people got their shots at. And both Moderna and Pfizer vaccines are coming here to Alabama today, those kid-sized ones. Kids who get the Moderna vaccine will have to get two shots while those who get Pfizer will need to get three. And it's been a long time coming to get these kid-sized doses here. And now that they're on their way, health leaders are really just hoping that parents sign their kids up to get vaccinated. I'm not advocating going out and getting infected before you get your vaccine. I am saying, though, that if you have been like 75% of all children in the United States infected with COVID, especially during this last Omicron wave in you know January and into February of this year, if you then go get vaccinated, as is now recommended for six months of age and over, you will have maximally protected your child uh, and, and done everything you can to keep them safe. Those tiny shots going into tiny arms pretty soon, and that could lead to some side effects. But a doctor say it's nothing that you should worry about as a parent. It's pretty typical. Same thing that you or I would get a sore arm as well as maybe a slight fever uh, as well after you get that shot for your kid. But again, doctors say that's normal and shouldn't deter you from signing up your child to get vaccinated. Reporting live in Huntsville this morning, Luke Idash, Way 31 News.